Hey, what's going on, buddy? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Golden Sun! Sorry for that at the beginning. That was kind of loud, wasn't it? That weird click noise. Uh, last episode, we made it back to home, and we found out our mom wasn't doing so good. Um, let's, let's try something here that I tried in my practice file, but it didn't work, and it confused me. Bye! Heal my mom, please! I don't want her to die! It's really weird. Because I swear this is what you're supposed to do. I thought something was wrong when I tried to do this. I think what I'm thinking of doing, uh, what I, what, why I think this is why what I had to do, unless it has to be cure for some reason. I don't think so though. Oh, we can't even use cure in the field. Never mind. I thought we had to cure our mom, but I guess not. I thought, I guess I was thinking of Wind Waker when we have to cure Grandma. I was trying to think like, why would I think this is the thing to do? <laughs> Who is it? Is it the innkeeper? Is it time to eat? No? Then who? Surprise, motherfucker! Isaac! Are you finally home? Have you completed your mission? Sorry, Mom. We kind of broke our promise. Oops. You haven't, have you? Have you forgotten your promise, Isaac? Yeah, it's kind of a double-edged sword here. One, we get to see our mom again, but two... Kind of sucks having, you know, we came here and we just have to leave again. You promised you want to come back until you complete your quest, right? Yep. So you broke your promise because you're worried about me? Who told you I was ill? The mayor? Or <coughs> was it the innkeeper? I'm not gonna tell you. No. <laughs> Are you telling me you're surprised to see me in bed? You can't get out of your promises just because you're worried about me. <laughs> That was weird. Portrait was all the way to the right and the cough was all the way to the left there. <laughs> I <coughs> was kind of cold, that's all. That's not what other people are telling me. I'm fine now. <laughs> Look. See? I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Go on, do your best to complete your quest, okay? Oh, that's sad. Don't, uh... Cough, cough. I'm sorry you seem so harsh, Isaac. I'm I'm so happy to see you. I'll be waiting for you to come home for good. Oh, that's so sad. And if we leave and come back... She will see her. She's in bed again, and we can no longer really talk to her. Oh, Kyle, don't go. Oh, she's dreaming about her husband. I think Dora's dreaming. I don't say I think Dora's. She doesn't say I think Mom is dreaming. Kyle, watch out! The boulder! The boulder. That's so sad! So... This is the last development we see of our mom in this entire game. So, we'll- I'll leave it up to you to try and make a theory as to what happens. We obviously, you know, we will eventually find out more about that, but... Not for a very, 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 very long time. Okay, the last thing is if you remember a long ass time ago, there's this boulder here. You must have so many memories of this cottage, don't you? Yup, yup. I thought so. You used to visit Creighton a lot, Isaac. You know why I feel so lonely whenever I come here? I wasn't even that close to Creighton. I mean, it is a very lonely area now. There's just one cottage, now there's, there's no one here. Except this kid. This kid's been staying here for forever. Because I'm wondering what lies beyond this fence. The one thing, person that says the same thing. But I feel like my adventure will begin once I pass this fence. Well, guess what, guy? I don't have the ability to do that. So obviously, we could not do this until we got the ability to use Lift, which we got in the Alton Mines. And yeah. Cuts a little bit. So in case you're wondering, we couldn't have just gone to Alt Mines and come back. There are like things that stop us from going back through the world the opposite way. So the only way, like this is like you had to be able to like, get through the Lamican Desert for the bridge to be fixed and go up. So we could finally go and explore up here. And I've always been confused why all these boxes and logs are here. Like who put them there? Why? This is the Veil Cave. <clears throat> there are a few things in here. Everything went down from here. I don't know why I had the feeling I did. Okay. Um, we've got a few options here. Let's start the one up here. Is there anything over here? Oh, remember that little creature. So the main purpose of like the Vault Cave and the Veil Cave are both the kind of Veil Cave is to um. Sorry, I mispronounced. That's why I said it a second time there. Oh. Hey, a ghost mage! The one thing we actually haven't seen here before. Great. Oh, right. Sap. Right. Attack of phone, steal HP. Those defense. Uh, ghost mages have... I think you go back a page here. Sorry, bump my mic. They're level 15? 
Isaac's health is fully uh, healed. Alright, now let's use the fifth level summon. Wait a minute. It's only the fourth one. What? So, yep, that's right. There are only... Uh, it only goes up to level four on the summon scale, which I always thought was kind of weird, but I guess I have to stop somewhere. You get more than four Jin, but that's okay. You give us an excuse to not only save up for it. Anyways, Ghost Mages, they have level 15, they have 161 hit points, they drop 110 gold, 80 experience points, they have a 6.25 chance of dropping a Bramble Seed. I thought I might level up there for some reason. They have the ability to use Whirlwind, freaking baby synergy, uh, Spire, which is also baby synergy, and Haunts, which is also baby synergy. This is really weird. You think you'd be able to push the log forward like you could others? But no, you can't. Alright, also in the cave here, you can find Ravengers, uh, Mad Vermin, Deathcap, Undead, and Fighter Bees. Uh, the Ghost Mage just fought, you can also find in the Vault Cave, so I probably should have actually stayed there and fought them, but that's okay. Uh, if you go up here... Alright, we already exploded that, right, right. So the only way left to go is over here. It's very interesting. I kinda wish I didn't always do this. Like, have, like, there's always a, a reveal circle. I kinda wish sometimes I just had, hey, I'm, Isaac's at 300 hit points now, that's crazy. It's got about to be more. 315, wow, that's insane. I've installed a tiny baby, well, let's put everyone's gen to uh, set here. Okay, everyone's above 200 hit points at least, that's good. Okay, so let's have this later. Yeah, I mean, I don't know, if they just have the two rocks there instead, I think it would have been cool because it's like, well, you know, you could just like, you could still use process of elimination. Oh, I can't go this way, can't go this way. Two weird rocks here. Let's try and use. Hey, as of now, 18. Also, wasn't Isaac that leveled up last time? Dang it. Uh, maximum HP goes up by 8, PB by 3, attack by 4, defense like 2, agility by 4, 146 coins. Yay! So, we'll do a few more battles here and then we'll probably start cutting. Uh, let's use move. Actually, I think I already have move. It's catch! What? Why is it catch? Why is it catch? When's the last time I used catch? Did I do that by accident? Weird. Um, nothing up here. Ooh, there's a chest over here. Oh, we got, oh, we got a nut. Pfft, baby. Freaking baby items. Alright, well, there's another way you can go though, at least. I love the slow motion that goes down for no real reason. It's actually... There you go. We only need to use, we only need to use move twice here, but eh, whatever. Yay! Slow motion. So we can move this log. I guess it's just the small logs. Also, when you roll these logs, they look very square, don't they? Oh, this is a permanent shortcut. If you leave the room and come back, this log will still be here for whatever reason. So, okay, I'll take it. Um, come on, please. In fact, maybe we should start using... Uh, do we have a void yet? Oh, really? I'll be able to... Yeah, okay, we do have a void. Let's start using a void, shall we? Oh, we should actually use the sacred feathers. That way we didn't have to trade gin or anything. Now that we fought everything, you want to go left here. There's nothing to the right, so don't worry about it. You'll see the dead end once we run around here. See, look at that dead end. So I'll just save you guys a couple seconds. A log here. Don't be an idiot like I did and push these logs and then accidentally exit the room. So this is what I did. I slid down this crevice, and for whatever reason, like, oh, I wonder what let's do here. I ran that way, and that resets the puzzle, and you have to go all the way around again. I think once you do this, it won't reset, but I'm not going to risk that, so we're just going to go through. <laughs> That's how you get that log across, for whatever reason. That's kind of cool, though. I like how it rolls across other logs. I don't know, I thought it was kind of a neat little puzzle. Weirdly enough, the Hulk gem. We just got a new synergy just in this random-ass cave. Uh, this, this gem is actually uh, Jupiter base, so we can actually equip it to the Ivan, and now we got a new synergy. What better way to test it than on Ginny? Why test on the Ginny, may be wondering? Well, because he's gonna forever run around. There's nothing to do. I actually find this really cool. So, we don't want to use Halt on it. Halt! Stop moving, stop a moving object. I don't know, it's all about that sound effect, it's all about everything. That's really cool. It freezes them in place, then you can come and collect them. You don't even fight them. Very, very weird. Yay! The Jupiter Ginny kite join Garrett. That's not right. So, uh, attack twice next round. So this is actually a very interesting Jin. I really like like the uh, kind of like ingenuity behind it. Is that the correct way to say that? I don't know. 
If you didn't listen, it's very quickly sh uh, filling up though. Um, let's go back a page here. So Kite! Where is he on my list here? He gives a, a plus 8 uh, hit, hit points base? Plus 8 hit points? Uh, plus 4 PP? Plus 3 agility? And yeah, every uh, when you use them, the next turn you'll be able to attack twice, which is really freaking cool, man. And of course, since it's a 5th gen, uh, there's... Uh, you do not get an addition. Dang it, that's all I'm gonna use. Stop that rock! Stop it! Since it's efficient, we don't get a new summon from it, which sucks. But oh well. We've seen all of the summons in this game now, unfortunately, which kind of tells us we are getting, you know, we're making a lot of progress. I wouldn't say we're closely on the game yet, but we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, I can't stop wondering what lies beyond this fence. Well, dude, you could go. Just go. I mean, there's a lot of scary monsters in there. I would not recommend it, but you could still go. And with that, we're actually done on the veil. So, uh, that took two, three episodes? I think it was three, wasn't it? To go from the ship. <laughs> so, after all this time, we can finally... Oh, that's not actually true. There are some actual differences now that we're... Uh, um, now that we've gone around the world a bit. Uh, there's something in Zien we could go to. And there's also something if we go back to the Mogul Forest. Or right before, at, at the uh, Fusion Temple. If you remember Nyampa there. Um, I won't spoil exactly what's going on with that, but I'm obviously not going to cut up because this is a pretty long-ass journey. No one needs healing, okay. And you could bet your ass I'm going to be using a lot of Sacred Feathers to get around here. So, I'm going to go through... So, this is going to be a long journey here. I'm going to show you on the map. We're going to have to go through... Um, well, here. First of all, Lumpa. There's nothing we can do here. If we go back here, we do not have the ability to do... Actually... There is something we could do about that now. I didn't even think about this. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> so here's the new baby mom. Oh, we should shoot. Ah, whatever. I say we should have shown the new Jin, but there's nothing really. We would not have two attack turns to do it. I actually came here on practice file. Let's see if these guys say anything different. They don't. You're from Clay, are you? Yes. You're here to save Hammond, are you? Yes. Return Hammond to Kelly very soon, just wait a little longer. That's what Donald told us to say. <laughs> Venture through the cave, they can't get into town. The gate in the cave can only be opened from the inside. Oh, thanks, buddy. So, if we go to the cave now. Water puddles. <gasps> wait a minute. Wait a cotton pick a minute. So, yeah, I actually did not think. Do not hit that switch, it will close the gate completely. You actually want to come over here? He's frost. And just like that, you can force open the door. Okay, I'm gonna preface this by saying I don't know much about this town. I did not come near my practice file. I'm gonna probably talk to too many people and find out things I don't really care to find out about. I don't mean to examine that grave specifically. I like this music a lot. It's like the peaceful music, which is weird because it's a town of thieves. Aha! I knew it. I was gonna sleep on. Let's just talk to that boss first. Honestly, there's like religion here. I think that thief, Donopo, is a terrible man. But it's not fair to blame the lumpy Lumpins for it, too. They need to care, they need to care too. We can't leave Lumpa! Not when Dodompa's men are watching like that. Well, no one's allowed to leave, I guess. Have you been in Lumpa long? Nope. Oh, so you're a new member of Dodompa's gang. Give me your face doesn't ring a bell. I guess you don't really stand out. Rude! Dude, I have cool spiky anime here. What do you mean? <laughs> I don't know anyone can enter Lumpa now with all the tight security. Explore around here a little bit. I like this town quite a bit, actually. The chi the chef from the inn has been delivering meals. Unfortunately, he says security is very tight even inside the fortress. The chef said that the fortress is scary. He never wants to go back. Yeah, I don't blame him, man. Is it true that Donopa kidnapped Hammett and extorted a ransom from him? Yes. I guess Donopa's men are telling the truth. Let's get the ransom. They'll set the hostages free no matter what. But the virgin caravan hasn't left yet. What's going on? I don't know. Oops, I didn't talk to him. I don't think so. Not even Dodompa do such a terrible thing. Well, Dodompa is too old to lead, so uh, so his men do whatever Dodompa says. So yeah, there's Dodompa and there's Dodompa. Ah, oh, Synergy's still in there. Lumba died when Dodompa was still young. Uh, it made Dodompa a lonely man. They say that's why he spoiled Dodompa so much. What a mistake that was. Ah, so he's spoiled. He's a spoiled little runt. Uh, let's talk to everyone outside first. I've had no freedom ever since the caravan came to this village. You can't leave the village, and no one is allowed in. I hate it. It's sure strange of Hammett to come here just get caught. I guess he had nowhere to go. 
Could've came to Veil, vale, though. I guess Veil vale doesn't really let in strangers a lot, though, do they? Hmm. Yeah, I guess really... I don't know. That's a tough call. Do you go back to Vault, where there's thieves or active thieves around? Do you go back... Do you try to go to Veil vale and convince them to let you in? Or do you go to Lump Lumpa, you know, a town known for thieves? I just thief Lumpa and his son Dompa, they were great men. The Dompa can do his evil deeds, but how can he live like this? If he makes any money, he should pass around to his poor villagers. Ah, oh my god, I can't believe... I can't believe I guessed there was something in there. Weird. So yeah, I'm just kind of freeballing this. What's in the well? Hear the sound of frogs coming from I was almost expecting it to say there's no water in there. Dompa has no idea what Dompa is doing. This village would change if Dompa heard about Dompa's evil deeds. So... In case you're not catching on, since the names are kind of confusing, Dompa, it goes Lumpa, and then Lumpa's son is Dompa, and then Dompa's son is Dorompa. Dorompa keeps Dompa hidden away in the forge. No, Dorompa, Dompa is Lumpa's son, and oh man, I just made it even more confusing. Dompa is Lumpa's son, and Dorompa is Dom Dompa's son. <laughs> Dorompa keeps Dompa hidden away in the forge, so they won't find out all the evil things Dorompa has been up to. Uh, I already talked to you. Let's make sure nothing else is about here. Alright, uh, let's make things less confusing. I haven't talked to you yet. You wanna see Dompa? Dompa's unfortunate. So you have to go over there if you wanna see him. Security is unfortunate. It's very tight. I believe it. Ah, a secret puddle in that rock for some reason. Weird. Fortress is guarded all day long. No one outside the fortress can get away ever see Dompa. Uh, who's at the end, I wonder? Dompa made a pretty penny for himself by capturing Hammett, but he doesn't care about what happens with the village. Well. I wish to have your finest room, sir. Huh? You wanna sleep at my place? Must be kidding. Go home and go to your own home and get rest. Damn it, man! Stop doing that! I just have to hang in there. I'm not closing my inn until the village is free. No. Of course not. With no travelers in town, no one wants to stay here. How does no one recognize I'm not from here? Do you wish. Do you want to hear about how I deliver meals to the fortress? I was blindfolded and got along a cool path. I walked for a while. I could hear my footsteps echoing, so it must have been an underground path. Jeez, man. This place sounds crazy. Feel bad for that poor man. They've locked, got locked up in the dungeon. Holy crap! No, oh, poor habit. <clears throat> Doesn't matter how much we clean or wait for customers. No one will come. <clears throat> this rate, I'll be fired before I know it. Lord, she's not the daughter of these people. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm all grunty. Just call me Gruntilda. Ha 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 ha. Sorry. My late grandfather traveled the continent of Wampa. He would be very sad to see what Donopa is doing now. I wonder who your uh, great grandpa is. <coughs> Lumpa used to be a good place, but not anymore. We may live in Lumpa, but we will never work for Donopa. Okay, so not everyone in the town's evil then. That's good to know. <coughs> Look in the oven. He's making thieves stew. It has very distinct taste. Interesting. Uh, what about the item shop? Can we buy stuff from the item shop at least? Oh god, there's a lot of stuff in here. Nothing for me. They bought a lost stock, which is why they're holding up. They bought a lost stock, which is why they're holding up. But I still feel bad for them and all their lost business. I don't know what that is. That, is he referencing the caravan? Do you have anything new for me? You do not. I don't know if you'll ever have anything new for me, to be honest. Empty bottle. I'm pretty sure that's the only rarity you'll ever have for me. Uh, if you get rid of this. I have a lot of vials, man. Uh, nothing else from you. We almost got 30 game tickets, the maximum amount we could hold. Uh, the gauntlets? Great. Great, mate. Anything you could sell? No, sir. And uh, nothing you could sell. Okay. Diddly -de 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 I've run out of things to talk about. But it's okay because this music is all fun. Fortress was built during Dompa's rule. He built this fortress so well, not even ants could sneak in. <laughs> Well, guess what? I am an ant. Uh, uh. Or do we need to turn into an ant synergy, perhaps? The inn chef is the only one who could enter the fortress. I don't know, I may have to get in there with him somehow. If the caravan emergence was captured, that was when they ordered the chef inside the fortress. Alright, two more houses to explore here, and then we could go, go see what's going on in the fortress. Well, uh, almost. There's there's one more mystery to unlock first. Lumpa was caught in the Great Flood while traveling with someone named Bobby. Remember these? Remember that name, you guys, Bobby. Very important later on. What kind of name is Bobby? Yeah, anyways, <laughs> I agree. 
I was in the oven for baby He's making thieves cookies in the shape of Tarumpa's face? <laughs> what? Lumpa passed away long ago when the world was hit by a huge flood. Lumpa had gone south and he was never seen again after the flood. South, eh? They say the flood claimed many lives all across the continent. It's also some very important piece of lore that you wouldn't think to, you'd ever need to know, but it is actually pretty important later on. Nothing. Village is sealed, so we can't buy or sell anything. Don't put on the care of our business. Rip. I'll have to close the shop down soon if things don't change. I'll sell you as much armor as I like once the village reopens. I should have bought more stuff while I had the chance. So yeah, if you try to talk to him here. Can't buy anything. Unfortunately, I thought that might happen, but I wasn't entirely sure. Oh well. Ooh, what kind of delicious garbage do we have in here? Two coins! Can't buy. That's actually pretty okay. You know, most of the towns give you pretty much garbage for their secret items, but some of them are okay. Alright, so this is actually a bit of a tricky thing to do. I remember this thing right here. I think we start the ladder. Right. Because if you use frost on this and then walk out of the uh, teleport, or sorry, the uh, reveal circle. Here, I'll show it here. Oh, uh, actually, we could, we could do it. Um, we don't want to jump across here, but as soon as you walk out of the reveal circle, it turns back to a rock. So you have to position yourself and use reveal kind of in a very particular spot. Obviously, that worked well, me using it uh, right at the ladder there. And it leads to nothing. Great. I'm just kidding. Oh! Oh, that's cool! The wall crumbled! Nice. There's a secret jail- Oh my god, I don't remember this! I mean, it's a thieves place. Water of life? Holy crap! 44 coins? Pfft, baby. Smoke bomb! Lucky man, I love this. I love the, the fanfare plant. Elixir! So much good stuff, so little time. And an antidote, here we go! Perfect. Hey, well, this is not- <laughs> This is not the turn I expect the episode to take. This is kind of an interesting place to end. I was going to try and go to the fortress now, but we are at 22 minutes. So I think I'm going to call it an episode there. Thank you all very much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. In the next episode, we'll see what we can do about that fortress to the north and see if we can maybe save Hammett. That sounds like a lot of fun, doesn't it? Even though I kind of already talked about that earlier. So you might know what's about to happen, but hey, if you don't, then don't spoil it for yourself. I'll talk to you guys next time. Remember to subscribe and like the video if you like to support me that's an amazing way to do it see you guys next time bye bye